and welcome to the roundup of this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 5 August 2022. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly correspondent Rebecca Campbell writes that Southern Africa lags in the adoption of sustainable aviation fuel, despite great potential. At a recent international air show, US-based global major aerospace group Boeing unveiled a new tool to model data, which was created to map the ways that the global commercial aviation sector could reach the international target of having net zero carbon emissions by 2050. The engineering news features focus on construction materials and equipment, where a strategy outlines the constructive value of wood and commercial and industrial property, where the sector pursues recovery amid various challenges. The Mining Weekly features focus on valves, where local manufacturers are feeling the pressure as payment delays continue. And water purification and treatment, where sensible water management is more evident at mines. This week's business leader is Yamkela Makupula, CEO of the South African Diamond Producers Organization. And as this week's cartoon shows, the president's plan to tackle load shedding is focused mainly on utility scale solutions, but also includes some space for micro level action, mostly in the form of rooftop solar. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time.